Were you and Donald Trump rivals? Rivals? He was in a totally different business than I. He was my uh, best supporter as I was for him because he built the buildings and we sold the buildings. So that was a very, a very comfortable relationship, yeah. He was never a realtor, per se, right? He was never real, well, I shouldn't say that. I think at one juncture he opened Trump brokerage, but it didn't do well and then he closed it. If I'm, not, and I'm not sure I'm right on that, but I think I am. But no, uh, no, you need developers. Every time a crane goes up in New York City, I open a new office. I just, hey, they're building more products, so you need the developers. Did Trump own the building or just put his name on the building? Initially, he owned everything that he built. He would build Trump Tower, that was his first big building after the high end on 42nd street which he didn't own i don't believe but he owned trump tower he owned trump plaza and then after that his name became so much bigger than his business that he started having an arrangement of kind of like leasing the name on a term and i wasn't privy to how that worked but that was the best arrangement of all no risk and a high premium for the use of the name the branding so you've sold a lot of places in his we offices. We sold so many of his properties. My top agent, Carrie Chiang, who's a, a tycoon in her own right, sold so many properties at Trump Plaza and Trump Tower at a time when there was a recession that he gave her a birthday party, but had, uh, I think it was 138 candles on the cake to represent every sale she did. She was selling 70% of his product at that juncture when every developer in town would have loved to have the sale. All right, the obvious, what do you mm -hmm. think of his run? Well, it's mind-boggling, mind-boggling to me. If someone had told me to take that seriously a year ago, like so many other people, I would have found it laughable. Uh, but now I see that what he's doing in this run is exactly what he did best, building his business. He's building a brand. He's always been phenomenally good with media. He's always made everything look bigger than what it was. He's always promised the moon and then changed his mind halfway down the track. And so that's his M.O. So he's running this campaign exactly how he built his real estate empire. I'm trying to figure it out. Do you like him? I do. I like him. Is there an honesty meter here? I respect his marketing savvy. He's phenomenal at it. He's, I'm sure you've heard everybody say he's a P.T. Barnum of our era, and it's definitely true. Uh, do I like him? Uh, no, I don't particularly like him because I don't like uh, things that, he stands for, and I don't agree with many of his opinions, let's just say I won't be having dinner with him tonight. Watch new episodes of Larry King Now, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, on demand on Aura TV and Hulu.